Well, SMAP tells us that having more parking spaces is actually one of the most, if not the number one request for travelers coming in and out of the airport here. And this project certainly going to make a big difference, although it is going to take some getting used to, of course, especially if you're trying to get to Terminal B. Now, the current hourly parking lot that's now closed has about 670 spaces. So by the time this other parking garage is built, we're going to see about eight times the number of spaces as the parking garage will have about 5,500 for travelers to choose from. So our airport reflects the growth of Sacramento. Sacramento is growing, so our airport has to keep up with that. Our businesses are growing, and we are here to serve the public in the business, leisure, leisure, all the travel categories. All right, so the main question for a lot of us being, what are my options going to be at this point? Well, during construction, anyone trying to park close to Terminal B will need to park in the garage or daily lot by Terminal A, although that is going to come with quite a walk. Or you can park in the east or west economy parking lot. Uh, again, that one's going to be too far away for you to walk, quite dangerous to make that walk, uh, according to SMF as well. So shuttles are what come in and out of there. So those are going to be a few of the options you'll have over over the next couple of years. And there's actually a really neat tracking feature that if you are waiting for a shuttle, you can track that in live time online. But this project is expected to take about two years with the lot hopefully opening by fall of 2026. And it comes with a price tag of about $390 million. We're now reporting live from SMF covering local news that matters. Chloe Curtis, Fox 40 News.